Okay. That's when she goes brain dead on cattle. Right? Yeah, she does. Oh, maybe a deer fly or horse fly or something? We have a lot of those. Sound like when you come, you bring me new calves. Huh? You always bring me new calves. Really? They calf when I come? I need to come more often. I wish it wasn't quite as far. Oh. Oh wow. That's okay. Well, they're pregnant a long time, aren't they? Nine months. Just like people. Just like people. Oh, I guess horses are even longer though, aren't they? I think they are. Look how nice. She's doing a nice job. Yes, she is. Well, Amy. Amy's trained a lot of corgis and to very high levels. She's pretty. But she said she needed a long-legged dog and she didn't want a border collie. <laughs> and I don't want purebred. No. And so intense little. Yep. Well, she hung around with me for a while and she thought, "You know, your Aussies aren't much different than my corgis as far as temperament." And and her dog gets along great with all of her dogs. I know. I know. From my viewpoint, it's sickening, but I'm happy for her. <laughs> well, you shouldn't be sickening. No, I'm just... You got the difference in the dog now, but that dog pushes your button. Yes. The dog has the capability of it. Yeah. You just don't know what she's doing wrong with. No, nope, that's absolutely right. The timing is so far off of it. Yes. That's why I say, them two posts is your goal. Don't let that dog inside that bush. Why? Okay. Downer. Lie down. Lie down. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I wasn't going to hit you. <laughs> Nope, nice job, Amy. Lie down, Rosie. Um, yeah, I think we both did, if it's possible. 